guys, how are you? What is the animal that has lots of legs and it goes like this? There's even a song that talks about this animal. The spider. Today I'm going to tell you the story about the spider and the beehive. Beehive is that house where the bzz, bzz, where the bees live. Are you guys ready? So let's start. Once upon a time, there was a village in Africa. And in the village in Africa, there was a small African boy. He lived there with his friend, a spider. Look, the spider was always on the top of his head. Well, the spider thought he was smarter, more intelligent, smarter than everybody else. But the boy had a special talent. He was able to find the biggest and sweetest fruits of all. Talking about fruits, what's your favorite fruit over there? Do you like to eat apples, mm, bananas, watermelon? Let's see what fruits do we have here on this page. Look, we have oranges, we have bananas, pineapple, a spider, which is not a fruit, right? The mango, plums, what else? Grapes. Well, one day, the spider was really hungry. He wanted to eat. So he said, Hey, boy, will you take me to the best plums, Amasia's plums? The boy, who was really nice, by the way, said, Yeah, let's go, let's go. So they went to the tree. They walked and walked and walked. And the boy said, Here, spider, this is my favorite plum. The spider felt really greedy. He ate every single plum he could find on the tree. He didn't leave any plums for the boy. He didn't even share them. And then the spider rubbed his belly and he said, Hmm, I've eaten the plums, but I'm hungry for bananas now. Hey, boy, will you take me to the best banana here in the island? The boy, who was really nice, of course, said, Yes, I can take you. So they went walking, 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 until the boy took him to his favorite banana tree. The spider ate every single banana but he didn't share any. <laughs> Spider was really greedy. So much. His belly was already full, but the spider said, mm, now, can you take me to the best honey? I love to eat honey. Mm, honey, who knows what honey is? Mel, exactly, honey, mel, honey. So the boy said, Let's go. I'll take you to the best, honey. They walked and walked and walked. And look how big the spider is right now. Wow. Do you remember in the beginning of the story, guys? The spider was a tiny little spider. Look. And now it's a big spider. So they walked and walked all the way through the jungle until the boy said, inside this hive, you will find the most 
delicious honey in the world. Ooh, look at the hive. Do you think there are bees inside? I don't know. Let's check. The spider squeezed a hole. Um furo, a hole. And he went into the hive. He ate all the sweet honey. Do you think he shared? Ele dividiu, he shared? Nope. He did not share. The spider stayed there, very big, eating, eating, eating up all the honey. And then, you will not believe what's gonna happen. The spider was ready to eat something else. But then, he tried to climb out of the hive. But then he said, oh, The spider had become so big, so fat, that he couldn't pass through the hole. It was stuck. He couldn't go. It was stuck. He said, help me, boy. Get me out of here. Look at his head. You can barely see it. And the boy said, you have not been nice to me. Goodbye, greedy spider. And off he went. The spider yelled and yelled, help, help, help. But nobody was there. Nobody listened. He was too far from the village. For the entire week, for seven days, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. He was stuck inside the hive, I mean, the hive, I mean. Look at this, he was so big, he couldn't go out. Then finally, after seven days, the spider finally squeezed out. And from this day on, the spider always shared with his friends. And this was the story of the spider and the beehive. Tell me about you guys. Have you been sharing your things with your siblings? with your sister, with your brother, with your mom and dad. Yeah, the boy was upset because the spider didn't share with him. Por isso que ela ficou lá dentro in the beehive. Não é legal não dividir, right? So let's try and share something. Agora me conta, o que, que vocês têm dividido aí na house de vocês? Bye guys, see you next time.